Artie Lane here with another video for hips and this is uh, another hack I call it. Um, it's very clever and it's restorative. You can have your strap, non-stretchy, tight buckle so it doesn't give at all and sling it around your outer hips. But you do that. First you have your loop already. I have mine ready. And then be near a wall. Have a little space on the wall. I have a yoga bolster here, so don't worry if you don't have that. You can also do that flat on the ground. But this will also help with other you know, lower back related um, issues. And it's softer, but if you have like a carpet or some mats underneath, you may not need this. I'll show it with this and without. So have that next to you with a handle close. Scooch super close to the wall. Touch it with the outer hip. And then as you, so that depends, if you're like in acute pain, you have, may have to not do this, but you can roll on your shoulder, this actually works, and then get your legs up. This goes over your legs, so feet. And I will get that right up here to where I feel my hip sockets outer hips here i show it without the bolster first i will get my heels to stretch up and then rest my legs out to the side so the strap actually takes those femur bones here the hips and gravity will bring them in deeper into the sockets so if you have tight hamstrings you need to be a little bit away from the wall but if you um, don't have tight hamstrings, you can be up close. It just has to feel like you can let them go. So if that doesn't feel that way, move away. Don't move too far. Just feel it out and let your legs drop and be held by this strap here on the outer hip. Spend a few minutes here, eyes closed and relax, lie on your back. And it, it draws those hips um, into a more compactness. Okay, so the way to get that bolster under the same idea, you're already on your back, legs up the wall, same thing, you have that strap around already. And then bend the knees, lift up, and then pull this out from, from under, from out to the side. So you're, you see how my, my tailbone is almost moving over it. So it's, a, it's, it's my, these front hips here, they are not falling this way and not behind in an overarch, but they're flat, so that's good. That's very nice if there is also sciatica, uh, um, underlying issues around the low back, lumbar spine, and it's a very relaxing place to be. And to come out, come out the same way, so you don't wanna sit up or anything, just feet together, bend the knees, lift up, push out, and then roll over to the side. And then, sorry that you didn't see my head, but my head wasn't important. It was just laying down. So make sure you're lifting it up. And thank you for watching and uh, try it.